Aisha is at the park. Aisha loves the swing. Aisha also likes to cycle. Read these sentences once more. The nouns in these sentences are Aisha, park, swing. A noun is a word used to name a person, animal, place or thing. Click the noun that is repeated in these sentences. Yes, Aisha is the noun that is repeated in these sentences. How do we avoid repeating the noun Aisha? Well, we can use the word she. A word used in place of a noun is called a pronoun. He, she, it, they, I, we, and you are all pronouns. Let's learn more about pronouns. Click the pronouns to learn more about them. Pasha is playing basketball. Pasha has thrown the ball high up in the air. How do we avoid repeating Pasha? We can use the word he. He is a pronoun. Pasha is playing basketball. He has thrown the ball high up in the air. He is used for a boy or a man. Since Pasha is a boy, you use he. Aisha is looking for the ball. Aisha sees something behind a tree. Here you can use the pronoun she in place of Aisha. She is a pronoun that is used for a girl or a woman. Aisha does not find the ball. She sees something else. Aisha sees a squirrel. The squirrel climbs the tree. Now, how do you avoid repeating the word squirrel? You use the pronoun it. The pronoun it is used for an animal. Aisha could not find the ball. It had disappeared. The pronoun it is also used for a thing. In this sentence, the pronoun it is used for the ball. Here are some sentences which have the pronouns he, she and it. Jiggy was hungry. He ate an apple. Jia is reading. She likes to read books on animals. This swing is broken. It needs to be repaired. What are Jia and Aisha doing? Jia and Aisha are playing on the seesaw. Instead of repeating Jia and Aisha, we can use they. When we speak about more than one person, we use the pronoun they. Jia heard some dogs barking. The dogs were chasing a man. They were barking loudly. Here we are talking of dogs, not one dog. So we use they in place of the noun dogs. Look, Jia has found some lovely pebbles. The pebbles are smooth. They look very pretty. Here they is used for the noun pebbles. We use they when talking about more than one thing. Here are some more sentences with the pronoun they. Jia and Jiggy said, that they would come for the party. The boys were playing football. They look tired. Pasha says, I am learning how to skate. Pasha will not say, Pasha is learning how to skate because he's talking about himself. So he uses the pronoun I to talk about himself. Pasha asks his trainer, Can I skate on one foot? Here too, Pasha is talking about himself and so he uses the pronoun I. I is always written as a capital letter, even when it is in the middle of a sentence. Here are some more sentences with the pronoun I. Can I play with the ball please? I have a red cycle. He and I like to play tennis. What are you doing now, Pasha and Aisha? Pasha says, we are climbing the tree. Pasha will not say, Pasha and Aisha are climbing the tree because he is talking about himself. Pasha will not say, I are climbing the tree because he is not talking only about himself. He is also talking about Aisha who is with him.
So, he uses the pronoun we. When you talk about yourself and someone else, use the pronoun we. Here are some more sentences with the pronoun we. Are we going for a movie on Saturday? We will go to the beach tomorrow. We are eating ice cream. Aisha and Parsha are having a race. Parsha says, you run very fast. Here Parsha says, you, because he's talking to Aisha. The pronoun you is used for the person we are speaking to. The gardener told Parsha and Aisha, children, you should not run here. It is slippery. You might fall. The pronoun you can also be used for both Aisha and Parsha. So we use you when we are talking about more than one person. Let's take a quick look at what we have learned about pronouns. A word used in place of a noun is called a pronoun. The pronoun, he is used for a boy or a man. The pronoun she is used for a girl or a woman. When you talk about more than one person other than you, use the pronoun they. Use the pronoun I when you talk about yourself.